what's your relationship like with failure? Because everybody knows to be a successful entrepreneur, to build great products, you have to fail fast. Um, but if you're struggling with, you know, enoughness, then it seems like that might limit your ability to want to fail f- fast. You know, it, it, it is certain that the more, the more successes you have under your belt, the easier it is to fail. Because you feel like if you've had, you know, nine out of 10 things have been successful and that 10th is not, it doesn't mean you are a failure. So one thing is I think separating like you being a failure versus the project or the the particular thing being a failure is very, very different. Which is hard. Which is very hard. Um, Toby, uh, who, you know, is founder of Shopify and the person I spend most of my time with, um, building this company over the last 13 or 14 years, he has this great line, which is that failure is the discovery of something that that didn't work. And when I think when you use that lens that failure is the discovery of something that didn't work, which he taught me, that made failure totally different. 